Let's get to it. Okay, YouTube, what's going on? It's Mesa back at it with some division. I haven't said that word, those words, in a long time. Kind of an impromptu Sunday video as to kind of, well, what, what happened with the division? Um, we were all pretty psyched, or at least uh, I know I was pretty psyched for April 12th when the incursion and the uh, free update launched. Uh, so let's talk about my thoughts and opinions, but more importantly, gather your thoughts and opinions in the comment section. So I finally got on um, a couple days ago, and I've been playing a little bit every day, put a good number of hours in today, and wandering around the dark zone by myself, because no one else in my friends list is on at all right now. And I gotta say a number of things, well, first off, definitely I like the, I guess, quality of life changes, all right? Let, let's start on a positive note. I like how you have the daily assignments, you've got weekly assignments, the UI seems a little bit better in terms of tracking things, and a little bit more things to do. So they changed everything around, so now you've got gear score, okay? Everything is about gear score. And um, when you go into the dark zone, all the bosses drop high ends, but usually, or at least the high ends I've gotten, haven't been good. But then again, I've only been roaming around by myself and killing bosses in DZ01, 2, and 3. I haven't gone up to DZ04, 5, and 6 just yet. I want to go in there with a the party. Now, the dark zone has always been my favorite part of this game. It's eerie, it's creepy, you never know what's going to happen. You're going to run into rogues, you're going to go rogue, whatever you're going to do. I like it, it's eerie, and there's a lot of loot in there. I have not been seeing, uh, for the number of hours I spent um, this whole weekend, really getting steamrolled by rogues, okay, or people that are glitching, I guess. I, I, I really haven't been paying attention to all the latest news and YouTube videos on The Division. I just know that I guess a lot of people, they did the incursion, they got a whole bunch of gear, the DPS, health, everything is just off the charts, they go into the dark zone, and they maul you. It really has not been my experience. Maybe it's just been luck, or maybe just no one's really playing right now. I don't know. I'm on PS4, okay? Now, one of the things I will say I'm pretty disappointed in was the actual Incursion Falcon Lost, okay? It was pretty boring, and I got one piece of gear, a uh, Sentry chess piece. I think it was Sentry, um, with perks that I didn't even like. It reduced my armor. See, I tried to keep my armor close to 65% weapon damage mitigation. So for Falcon Lost, I mean, I was kind of hoping it was going to be... Like a long, let's see, kind of like almost a really long, difficult story mission or challenge mode mission where you're going through different rooms and different parts of uh, a map or buildings and things. Not just one big stupid room and waves of enemy. I mean, yeah, there's some objectives in there with planting the bombs and everything and destroying the tank. But I don't know, really not feeling the... um. Not feeling Falcon Lost at all, actually. I was kind of hoping for a bit more in terms of what you actually do in it. To spend that much time uh, fighting off those waves, and it is pretty difficult. Don't get me wrong, it is difficult. But it was kind of boring just being in the same place the whole time. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. And if that means that you got to do that to get the gear sets and the end game, quote unquote, end game content, I don't know. Not digging it at all. Uh, for me, gear wise, I just been uh, trying to get Path of the Nomad. And before you shit can it and say you need the other ones. I like Path of the Nomad because it's kind of built uh, for solo people. <laughs> right now, there's no one on. It's just me roaming around the Dark Zone. I like it. So I went up to the uh, church uh, church vendor in DZ06, bought some gear and bought some blueprints there, and uh, just been trying to build that um, and just trying to buy. Oh, I got this killer AUG I'm using here right now. I absolutely adore this thing. Let me know if you want, to, want me to do a review on it. So after playing over the weekend and just getting a few pieces of the Nomad gear, uh, my gear score is 190, which I guess is not bad, or it's not great, that's for sure. Um, yeah, just kind of mix matching stuff, and I also didn't like the fact that once I got some of this new gear, including what I got from Falcon Lost, it kind of, it well, first off, it dropped my armor down a lot, which I didn't like. So spending all that time to get that one piece of gear. Now, as you saw over from and those over and over supply to get drop clips the full in the beginning, set, I got not feeling nothing. it, guys. <laughs> not feeling the only all. thing that was cool was there's a boss there for you to kill. You get some Phoenix credits, Division Tech, uh, um, possibly a high end you might like. Only once, actually, I did get a, um, I'm not, I'm pretty sure it was a Path of the Nomad set of gloves from one in the, in DZ1, actually. I was pretty, uh, I was pretty surprised. It was like two other guys with me, and um, I was by myself. But I ran, <laughs> I ran in front of him, opened that thing up, just because it was my first one. And sure enough, it gave me one of these. Yeah, that's one of the gloves right there. 
and uh, I was surprised those guys didn't kill me. But uh, the supply drops, uh, there needs to be better things in them. Or I don't know, what's been your experience with the supply drops? Have you gotten good stuff out of them? So I'm still going to play it. Uh, I'm still going to upload some videos here and there. I do like this game. I really do. I just think they kind of dropped the ball a little bit on this incursion. Really looking forward to the first uh, expansion. I did buy the season pass. I'm on PS4, so I'll be getting it late. Whatever, not a big deal. But let me know in the comment section what you guys have been thinking of um, of this free update. Have you guys been playing a lot? Guys, I've been just glued to Destiny, man. De the April update brought the fun back. I've really been enjoying Destiny just in terms of the loot. I even enjoy Crucible more than I ever have. I dare to say that Crucible feels the most balanced it's been in a long time. And I say that because I'm not just uh, pinned to one to two guns I'm using every time I go into PvP. I'm just having a really good time with just playing with so many different guns. But this is not about Destiny, it's about the Division. All in all, I like the game. I just think the incursion, the free update, eh, not so great. And I'm looking forward to going into the Dark Sun with a full party. So, friends, you, you know who you are. Get online. We could go into DZ 4, 5, and 6 and uh, have some fun and maybe go rogue in a few times. But I'm, God forbid we run into these uh, glitchers out there, whatever, that I've been seeing on Twitter where they got like a million DPS or something. I don't know. Thanks, everyone who shows everyone how to do that shit. Anyway, Babble Mode Cage, drop a like on this video only if you see fit. Follow me on Twitter at MaceTron. Check out my stream. A link's will be in the description. And that's it. I'm out of here like Vladimir.